Okay, so we've got our basic email stuff kind of set up here in Postfix Admin. Here, here we are in Postfix Admin. Got our stuff basically set up. So we've got this email address right here. There it is. And then it's it's got a forward. Okay, but you know, maybe that matters, maybe it doesn't, but we've got this is a real email. That's the thing. It's a mailbox. It's not just an alias. It's a mailbox. You can actually log in with it. You can actually use it. You can actually use it on, uh, you know, like Thunderbird or Outlook or on the email on your phone can actually log into that. All right, so I'm going to come over here to my Gmail. I'm going to show you how to set up some stuff in Gmail. This is to make sure that we know how all this works. So we're going to go to our settings. Settings here. All right, now here we're going to go on over to accounts and import. There's two important settings we're going to look at. Accounts and import right here. That's so you can use Gmail to send from that address right there. Oh, see that little space at the end? Careful. That could mess you up if you triple click. You just be aware of that. All right. So, accounts and import. That's if I want to send from that email address using Gmail. Right now, this is set up to forward to my Gmail. Now, a lot of people choose to do this. Here I've got it forwarding to my Gmail. And over here I'm going to set it up to send from my Gmail. Okay, well here I am. I'm Jesse Steele and then this is my Gmail here, which is all locked down. So you don't you know, no hackiness. And I'm not going to check this, so spam it all you want. I'll, I'll report you. <laughs> well, I'm going to add another email address right here. Now, this is for checking mail from another account. Send mail as. That's one thing. This is checking email from another account. Okay, well, we're going to go over here on our email address. Oh, oh, there we are. Here we are. Here's the email address. Let's see if this works. Oh, no, that's my Gmail. I, I, I copy. I got the wrong thing. Copied and pasted. And come over here. Okay, we want to. Oh, that little space at the end there is sneaky. So we don't want that. We're going to get it the right way. There we go. Control C to copy. All right. Oh, wait. Where'd my window go? Well, I'm using Ubuntu. I'm going to smash up in this corner. Come over here and switch. Oh, isn't that convenient? Okay. Paste. There we are. Paste. Treat as an alias. Um, that might matter. Now, listen, these Gmail settings, you know, can be finicky, so just pay attention to everything. Uh, I'm. I'm I'm going to I'll leave it. I don't really think it matters. So you specify a different reply to address. It's optional. I know I I I don't want to. I don't want a different reply to address cuz you can do that if you have a reason or but if you don't you, you know this is fine. We'll treat this as an alias for now. In fact, that's what this is. This is an alias because everything here it's going to that address and going to Gmail by forwarding. So I probably do want to treat it as an alias because that's what this is. Wait, wait, where'd my box go? Oh, up here. Switch windows over. There we are. Okay, so I'm, I'm not going to set a reply to address. Next step. Here we go. Now the username. And there we are. SMTV email. Okay. Uh, it probably should be this. I mean, you, you got to follow the instructions for your particular server, but I'm going to do the full email address there. I'm going to follow the default ports here. TLS, let's see how that works. It, 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 Gmail can be finicky. So we're going to go through this. Our password's going to be... Yeah, that's the password. Now, I think everything's right, but let's try. Add account, it's going to check. It's going to see... Oh, it doesn't like it. Well, let's try SSL. And that, that is that. I don't know. No, wait, hold on. Let's change our uh, SMTP. Twenty-five is a good typical. Let's try four sixty-five. Let's let's try that one. See if it works. Oh, got to enter the password again. Okay. Four sixty-five is going to do. Uh, see if you're doing TLS. It's going to want five eighty-seven. Well, it, we don't have that set up. So we're 465. It wants SSL. Let's see if it's working. Let's see if Gmail's happy with it. Okay, Gmail liked it. Gmail liked it. Okay, well, now I have to go check that email and see what's in it. So here's what I'm going to do. 
I'm going to come over here to Thunderbird and I'm going to add the same account in Thunderbird. No, here's my Thunderbird. Oh, it wants to set up a, oh, that, that's my username here. It, it, it detected my, see, see, I'm the username ZDemo. That way it goes to the end of the list. ZDemo, no, 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 no. I'm, my name is Super User. That's my name. Okay, well, I'm, I'm going to put my email address in here. It's u.verb.inc. It, remember, it's, it's the same thing we had. Same email. I'm not going to go show you. We'll remember my password. Well, we'll click on the password. Oh, you're, whatever. Okay, A, B, C. Oh, oh, I, oh. You're, you, you might have found out my, my password of the server I'm, that's no longer live. Okay, it's looking up everything. See, it's smart. A manual config. I'm going to go over here and make sure everything's right. It should be. Okay. There we go. We're all logged in. Now here's our Gmail confirmation right there. We'll click on it. Now that's what's necessary over here. Now here's the thing. We don't need this. We've got this link here, so we don't need this. So I'm, I'm just going to, I, I, I could, I could uh, take this number. I can copy it in here and click verify. Or I can just click on this big long great big enormous link now remember what we said about clickies urls and clicking that blue thing could be hacked see see look down here on the bottom of the screen down here watch it we hover that see that that tells us what the link really is and it's long i don't don't be hackable copy the whole thing control c i'm, I'm not going to do it this way i could but i'm just going to show you how this works and come up here and i'm just going to Copy and we actually, you know what? Let's look come over here. Here we go. Enter new tab. That's fine. There we go. Please confirm mail sending. Click here. Confirm. See, please confirm. Confirm. So I got success. Okay. So now it works. So Gmail's got it working. So I've used this to check my email. Now, by the way, all this stuff we're looking at in Gmail, look right there in this welcome message. Now on my server, I've got all the information right there. There it is. Everything we've been looking at. How all this works. If you've, you've got to look at how to make stuff work or whatever. That's what I do for my customers anyway. Okay, so here we are here. Now we can send mail as the SU, as the super user. Oh, it says, it says I'm very, let's, let, let's, let, let's refresh this and watch that verify thing there. And go on and, and, and then Gmail and then so back over here and and it's still going and it's a bit okay there we are mail sent through you secure connection there it is now i can make that my default right there see watch this i click on compose there i am i'm sending it from my gmail but i can change it to that look at that okay i'm gonna close this here and watch this i can make this my default see and again where are we we're in settings see here we're in these settings and we're over here settings account import Send mail as make default. Here, click this. Now it's the default. Compose. Oh, look, I'm sending it from that one. 